guys, it is Saturday. I'm on uh, my Totoro coffee here, <laughs> as I call it. <laughs> I'm back on the Bastillo. Really enjoyed Lavazza. I'll polish that off. Um, I'm thinking of alternating between Italy and Cuba. Um, I don't know. Today, this is uh, so this is Fourth of July weekend here in the United States, We're celebrating our independence. It's actually on Tuesday, Fourth of July falls. Exciting stuff. Um, and my mom is on her way over to pick me up. We're gonna go to lunch, and she has requested uh, that we go to a barbecue restaurant. So disclaimer, if you're new here, um, and you may have watched my video yesterday, I posted a video about cruelty-free skincare, and now I'm taking you guys to a barbecue restaurant. <laughs> but um, I, um, you know, as I said, I'm not a card-carrying vegan, and uh, my mom is not vegan or vegetarian. And barbecue is sort of a, and barbecue is a tradition for uh, Memorial Day and Fourth of July and summertime. And here in Texas, the barbecue is famous. And my mom's new to Texas uh, for her to miss out on trying it, um, just because I don't really eat meat. Um, and so we're gonna go, so disclaimer, we're gonna go to a barbecue restaurant. So if you're offended by the appearance of meat, I will warn you before I show it. That is what's going on. I had, um, I did a, a mambo combo of Beauty Dust and the Beauty E.T. this morning, because the Beauty E.T., like I said in my other video, doesn't seem to have any flavor to it, but, but Beauty Dust does, so I'm kind of mixing and matching them, and that seems to be working. That brightening mask, um, you know, didn't seem to offend me. I really like the um, the cream shop um, stuff. I mean, none of it's really like essential. It's more fun. Oh, but I have to show off. One of my friends sent me the most beautiful handmade wreath that I have on the front of my door. I mean, you guys, I'm just completely blown away by her craftsmanship. See how pretty that is, guys? Um, it's like made out of this burlap. So beautiful. And she knows I like navy blue. And there's the A for my first name. So cool. That's cool. baked potato and coleslaw so we're here in uh, spring old town spring texas it's a cute little town with lots of shops and stuff you can get fried twinkies fried snickers fried oreos <laughs> Rubber duckies, anyone? <laughs> Light up rubber duckies. <laughs> Ooh, they've got their own, uh... These go in the shower and they steam. Oh, look at the sweet little lamb ones. These are cute. <laughs> Maybe his old wedding dress, it looks like. Oh, that's cute. Crochet pin cushions. Okay. All right, 
They're not here for their uh, doll hospital, so we're gonna check this place out. American Girl look-alike dolls. I don't like the look-alike. Oh, this is cute. Oh, look, a Girl Scout that uniform. That is so player. cute. Dolls, cute. Oh, these are nice furniture for American Girl doll. I had one of those. Still have it. <laughs> I had Samantha. Look, special baby doll, sh doll shoes. I like those dolls. What is it so cute? Oh yeah, no. That's the evil, no, no, no. Not right yeah. Not right yeah. uh -uh. Lynette Luana Harper. Oh, Can't really. Look at this. You know, it's been so long for Pepsi. Oh, oh, smocking is so pretty. So that is so cute. Oh, look, though. Oh, oh, Shirley Temple dolls, Mommy. Well, let me see. The old timey Shirley oh, Temple oh, dolls. That's a really nice one. Can't see because of the glare, but they're really nice, well preserved. Oh, isn't he sweet, he be? Yeah, that is cute. Cute bangs. Right. Okay. Yeah. No. No My mom is saying she had this doll. Tiny tears. But she buried her, I guess. <laughs> well, this is nowhere near as jazzy as mine. These rays only wish they could be as cool as mine. <laughs> with the uh, smocking on it. Too bad I don't know anybody with a little baby girl. How cute are these? Bonnie baby. Oh, look at the little bathing suit. Not very sun protective. <laughs> oh, this one's so cute. Look at the little, look at the old timey. Uh, That's for today. Americana That's one. That's so cute. Here's a cute little honeybee one. Look at the bottom. Oh, <laughs> that's cute. Here bows. Plenty. These are pretty. Mm -hmm. These are pretty. We actually like this. Yeah, that's nice. <laughs> Pricks are upper. It's nice and soft. Here in this toy store, look how cute these little lined up woolly walkers are. <laughs> Could totally live in here. <laughs> Looks very hospitable. <laughs> Wooden paper dolls? Cool. Oh, look at these lunch boxes. Oh, those are cute. 
Adorable. Yeah, they really are. Oh, and they have wheels on the bottom. Those are nice. Yeah, they're super nice. Those are nice. A little they're ducky. They're really well made. They are. I've never seen them before. Have you? No. First friends. First time for everything. <laughs> it's cute. Look, a little uh, kangaroo. Yeah, the more you look at them, they kind of grow on you. They're really sweet, yeah. Look, there's a little car you can put them in. Like a little barn. Oh, I kind of like these. Yeah. Pretty little fluffy slippers. Oh, those are pretty. Except I don't like to have my feet out. I don't like those as much. The loved ones are cute. Oh, the ones with paws on them are sweet. I wonder if they have those. Oh, those have bunnies on them? Oh. They'd get gingy though. Get icky, probably, easily. Does she have carpet? This is a new Yankee scent. Peach Comma. Hmm. Oh, that's nice. I like that one. They always do it in here. Let's go in here so I can inhale the sugar. <laughs> the candy store. Oh look, it's the Japanese Kit Kats. I've always wanted to try one of these green tea Kit Kats. I don't want to spend a dollar on a Kit Kat. The strawberry? Cool. Oh, these look good. They're like root beer barrels, but all different flavors yeah, the of soda. Lemon and lime. They have Pocky. Whoa, look at all these different kinds of Mentos. Caramel. Coconut pineapple. Coconut pineapple. I think you like gooey nuts. <laughs> yeah, if I hadn't consumed that pecan pie, I might go for this. <laughs> How much is that? I don't know. We'll have that tomorrow. Two dollars? Mm. Oh, you like moon pies. I don't think I've ever had one before. Yeah, I do like moon pies. Pecan logs? Have you ever had? This looks I don't like. I there's anything here I've never, never had. Um, My mom's a uh, candied nut connoisseur. Oh, you like Abba's Abba's, too. Yeah, my favorite was the bottom of this Turkish taffy. Yeah? I don't know what's happened to that. It's probably... I've never seen that. Yeah. Oh, I don't like these. I do, <laughs> but I inhale them. I don't really like gummy. <laughs> it's cooling, man. <laughs> Come here, I want to show you a candy back here. 
Look at all the taffy. <laughs> well, hey guys, I'm back from a fun outing with my mom and I uh, went to the gym and now I'm coming in with kind of the last thing I have for my Asian skincare haul that I haven't tried out in the realm of snail secretion. It's the Tony Moly Intense Care Snail Hand Mask and um, I put this on um, after I got out of the shower to my wet hands. And it says you're supposed to leave them on for 20 minutes. They've been on for about, I don't know, say 18, but I think you can't OD on, on the snail. Evoking a little lunch lady couture here. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. As far as these snail secretion things, I don't know. I haven't, I haven't been too, too impressed with the Maison uh, snail snail the i haven't been too impressed with the my the multifunctional formula all-in-one snail repair cream by my mizon um that's supposedly 92 percent snail extract um it, to me it's like kind of just a waterier version of the hot alapo super plumping gel cream with um you know it just doesn't offer that much um underneath things i you know it it, it, it all be just becomes layering and layering of of more or less the same kind of thing. So, pluck the plastic off. I think I was maybe supposed to take the plastic off at one time. It says I'm supposed to pat it in. Um, ooh, kind of goopy. Um, and now I'm going to come in with, I showed this to you guys last night in my um, cruelty free kind of skincare products, the Shikai um, Borage Therapy Advanced Formula Fragrance Free. And I like this stuff. It's not, however, like a body moisturizer in the sense that CeraVe cream is um, for like really intense dry winter itch but it is really nice and the reason I say that is it comes out very liquidy um, because I think it's mostly oil based but it feels really nice going on um, I'm just putting it here over the snail and ooh that feels nice just to kind of sneal, sneal the, just to kind of seal the snail into the skin um, but I don't think th this this product, however, uh, while I like it and it's great as a summertime moisturizer, I don't think it's very good as like a winter body dry skin thing. Uh, but it's nice. Some of you all have asked me about an, an approach to oil-based cleansing for removing sunscreen from the body rather than using a harsh soap. And I'm kind of thinking that this might be a good one because it's largely oil-based. Uh, it's got safflower seed oil in it and jojoba oil. It's, it's pretty wild. Watery. I think it might actually be good in that capacity. They look pretty bright. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of fun. I can see how that's really nice. But yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog today. I'm going to conclude it here. Um, give this video a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. And as always, don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.